Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Hyperlinks are references to web pages that a visitor can click to be taken to that page. Hyperlinks that are used between two pages within a site are referred to as internal links, also called relative links. Hyperlinks that link to web pages outside of your site are referred to as external links, also called absolute links. Usually, as you create a link, you already roughly know the link's destination, and this will also tell you whether it's an internal or external link. To create a hyperlink, first select the object that you want as the hyperlink. This can be text or a graphic. Then, click Insert in the menu bar, and then click Hyperlink. You could also click the Hyperlink button in the standard toolbar. The hyperlink dialog box works a bit differently in front page 2000 than it does from to front page 2002 and 2003, so we'll look at front page 2000 first. If you're creating an internal link, you can simply select the page that you want to link to in the available list. You'll notice once you click one of these pages, the URL field automatically fills in. What you also may notice is that there's no www or HTTP at the front of this URL. That's because with internal or relative links, this isn't necessary. If you'd like to create an external hyperlink, simply enter the URL that you'd like the link to load. Be sure you include the HTTP colon slash slash before the web address. If you're not exactly sure what the URL is, you can click the Use Your Web Browser to Select a Page or File button just to the right of the URL field. This will automatically open your web browser with a message that tells you to simply browse to the page you want to use and then switch back to Microsoft front page. So just for a quick example, I'll go to google.com and once I find my page, go back to front page without closing your web browser. Once you switch back, you'll notice that the URL has filled into the URL field. Once you've selected a URL, you can click the target frame button to change the target for this page. The target defines where the new URL should load. Your options are same page, whole page, new window, and parent frame. A common target is new window. You may have seen links like this when you click a link and a new browser window opens and loads the new URL. Once you've selected a target, click OK. Then to finish the hyperlink process, click OK in the Create Hyperlink dialog box. Now let's take a look at front page 2002 and 2003. Again, select the text or graphic that you want to convert to a hyperlink and either click the insert hyperlink button in the standard toolbar or click insert in the menu bar and then click hyperlink. You can already see this dialog box looks quite different than that in front page 2000. In this dialog box, you first select an option from the Link To section. Existing file or web page, place in this document, create new document, or email address. As you click these options, you'll notice that your options to the right immediately change. For internal or external hyperlinks, select Existing File or Web Page. To create an internal hyperlink, Simply select one of the files from the list to the right. For an external hyperlink, 
you can click the Address Fields drop-down to view a list of some of your, your most recently viewed pages. You can also click the Browse the Web button to open up your web browser just like you would in Front Page 2000. Again, you would then navigate to the page you'd like to use, and once it's fully loaded, switch back to Front Page. To set the target frame, click the Target Frame button. Your options here are the same as they were for Front Page 2000. Same frame, whole page, new window, or parent frame. Once you select one, click OK. It's not absolutely necessary to select a target frame. If you don't select one, the URL will simply load into the current browser window. Once you're finished, click OK. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.